What's up, YouTube? This is Dilio T2K YouTube channel. People call me Dilio T2K, but my name is Dilio. Um, in this video, we're going to just take a slow walk uh, through some piano sounds of the Integra stepping right here. And before I do, I just want to let you know I got a new loop kit out, loop pack out called Permission, based off of the Bobby Brown New Jack Swing era. Uh, first in the series of loop packs I'm going to be dropping at my website at dilioT2K.com. Make sure you check that out, all right? So I'm going to demo this. I saw the comments. I'm like, okay, yeah, I get it. I would want it demoed too and not just talked about. So and now that the talking's out the way, um, I'm going to stroll through like five sounds. I'm going to play a couple of songs and just stroll through some of the presets on there. Uh, the way that I have this set up is that I have the Kai as the controller. We're, we're using the Akai software and I have it connected USB to this unit but I have the XLR outputs of it coming here to my uh, audio interface, which is going to the Apollo. And I think my, uh, my 1824 is recording a result, all right? So that's, once again, just review, because I didn't show it on the screen. Terra 7, controlled by Idea Kai, right? USB, USB MIDI to this right here. XLR outs to my input right there to your ears, all right? So let's look at some of the sounds, or let's listen to some of the sounds, all right? So the first one is the full gram. This is the flagship of every keyboard, every device that we have that is sampled is the seller. I don't like is the um that reverb but i can easily access the reverb settings and dial that back i do feel like a lot of these presets are <laughs> a little bit too drowned in reverb but that might have been the style at the time when they were building this though see there's no reverb there That's called Full Grand. And another song. Just a demo. Messing up that riff. So it has sort of a sound module y flavor. It's good, but it has a sound module flavor. Let's look at another preset. This is this is a piano sound you're gonna recognize <laughs> as soon as I as soon as I play it. <laughs> I can't even play my song right. But it sounds like that era, doesn't it? This is the 128 piano. This is, we've heard this on the 1080s <laughs> and a 58. Definitely a 1080. This is a OG rolling piano sound. You've heard this. There's no stereo field. No stereo field at all. Like church service. And that's just show you sort of the things right there. We're going to go to another one. Now, how I'm doing this is I have like multiple presets on different MIDI channels, right? 
so I can instantly go in between. So I went between this one and this one. Ooh. Now this one's off of um, expansion. It's called Steady Grand. This is off of X SRX02. I don't know what the name of that is, but this is actually a, an expansion that's loaded right now in this unit. Oof. See, that's more. See, this doesn't sound as sound modulated to me. So it's a little different. You kill still get a little bit of that. And you know what? Just for reference, we're gonna load up the uh MPC piano. This is the MPC piano right now. This is not this, this is the MPC. All right, and we're back on the rolling. NPC. Come on, NPC. You know what I was trying to do. Come on. I'm just trying to put some data on there real quick. Because I don't think I'm going to save it. PC. Definitely, it, it you know you can hear the the difference in time of sampling technique between the two. All right, let's go to another one. This one is called Soft Pad Piano. I like this one because it mixes the piano and pass together, but I have to do two channels. So I'll, I'd use this. But it's washed in that reverb van. Integra Seven. This is up SRX02, soft pad, grand. No after touch. And this was off of another expansion called Stereo Grand. This reminds me of Church in 90s R&B. <laughs> and then just for reference, here's the MPC. More low end on the MPC one. So you hear a lot of different nuances of it. It's still usable, though I would have to lean more towards the MPC's piano for certain things. And that's the thing. And also, it, there's two things. One is how you play it. Because if you can play the piano really good, it matters less how it sounds to me. Because if you can really play it good, you, you can play, play. Um, it, it's, it's, it's a different thing. That's the first thing. And two, um, sometimes you want, as a creative person, as a music producer, sometimes you want more of a sound moduli piano. And then other times you want more of a realistic piano. Um, I don't have Keyscape uh, running right now, so I can't really demo that. But this just shows you the difference between the two. And uh, I, really, I really like, I just, it's fun. It's fun just exploring different piano sounds. 
So if I want to give you like, if I want to take you somewhere nostalgic, you know, I'll go here with it. Because that's what they used at the time. Now here's the, the natural grind. More stereo image. Here's the NPC. It's even more body. This is the NPC plugin that they released for the NPC. Right, so that's the Integra. Well, that was you just heard the NPC, which is oops, it did want to fade to black, which is this unit right here. And um, you know, I think that it's just a, I think it's just a pretty cool unit. It's fun. It does have that sound moduli flavor, but if you play it right, most but like I said, this is just producers caring about this. The the person who's just there to enjoy music, who wants to hear something nice doesn't really care about that. And if you're making some good music that people can feel that they can meditate to or cling to or just drive to or work to, um, it it doesn't really matter. But I just I just appreciate I've always been a fan of technology. Like I said, it took me a long time to get my hands on one of these. Um and so now that I have it and I'm finally talking about I had this for a while. You've probably seen it in my videos. I had this for a while I ain't talk about it. So that's it. So if you want to see me demo more sounds, I need your feedback. Let me know what you think about this. Um, it's a fun use. It sounds good. It does have that sound moduli rompler flavor, but it's still it's still pretty cool. So if you, if there's a certain sound or sound set or sound type, because obviously I can't demo all the sounds in one video, let me know in the comments below. I love to hear your feedback. Um, maybe suggest some sound combinations with it. And uh, we could continue to grow. And it's, it's easy because it's all MIDI. So I could actually put different parts on on there. And then uh, we could talk about how I use it in the studio. So I want to continue the conversation going. Please hit me back when you can. Like, comment, subscribe. You're watching Delia T2K. And uh, it's good to be back.